Farming sure has changed. Come along with us as we join in the learning and fun of the Harvest Festival at the Reynolds Alberta Museum. Come on, let's go! <laughs> hey, Becker Trekkers! We're here at the Reynolds Alberta Museum to see some harvest action. Woo! Come on, let's go check it out. Woo! Or you can smell the grease in the oil. Oh, there's Farmer Anton and Farmer Matea. Boy, they even had a Canadian tire back in them days. They <laughs> just smell the grease, eh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Got not a lot of good food. There's a little one. Let's go sit. Okay, I'm just gonna get a shot of a few of these. <laughs> Kerosene. Oh, look at the little caterpillar. Yeah, old John Deere. Are we getting a little newer here? A little more modern? Gotta love those Deere John tractors. Now, here we go. Some big heavy iron here. We'll drive tractors, big combines. They did it back in the day. Pretty cool to see some of this old history. These old engines running. Here's an old steamer. Are you guys hauling grain? Oh, this is great! The wheat? Oh, it feels so weird. I love it though. Nice and refreshing. So satisfying. And you can dump it in. Wow, dump it. Okay, you're gonna go milk a cow? Yeah. Couple people. You wanna milk the cow? Okay, ready? You show us how it's done. No, you got to sit. I don't know how it's done. 
You gotta squeeze. Squeeze Mateo. Yeah. You're not so much of a With your hand like this. I milked all this. Grab your tractor, honey. Yeah, from you. So for the twine here, this is our rope making machine. This is gonna do all the magic for us. So we need to attach this to the machine. How are we gonna do that? Not quite, so I'm actually gonna make a slip knot here. Just by going like that. Oh, and slip knot. The beauty of the slip knot is it slips, but only in one direction. Cool. Well, on this end, it won't do anything. So that stays on there, and now it's on there, and even if I pulled really hard, I can tip the machine over. So, good little knot. But now, I need somebody to actually hook this onto. Are you gonna go grab that? Oh, you haven't. All right, maybe back up. How long do you want the rope? Okay, that's all right. We can do this one. Mateo, what are you making? Rope. Rope? Oh, look at that. Isn't that cool? Around your finger again. Yeah, keep those fingers up. Around again. Now I'm just doing it one time on each hook. If we wanted to make a really thick rope, we could do it more than once. I'm going to bring it around the opposite way this time. Oh, isn't that neat? Now. I'm actually gonna take this slip knot off the machine and undo it. Because now I'm gonna tie a new knot, which is actually a square knot here. A square knot. A square knot. And with the square knot, oh, okay. I can attach it back to the machine here. Cool. But now I need to make sure I did everything right. So the beauty of this little handy device here is if I slide it all the way up, let's go. Perfect. Now I can tell I did it right because I have our triangle here. If I messed up, we'd have some weird random shape. <laughs> so I'm gonna use this handy dandy little hook here. See that? Put it back on. Line. So I'll get you to hold on to this actually. We're now Captain Hook. Good job. You've been Captain promoted. Hook. Did you hear that, Mateo? Now get a holder for the separator. Ready? Oh. Oh, maybe. Oh, oh, that's okay. oh, don't worry, there's plenty of hands that I can do with things here. So yeah, I'll get you to hold that. This will be on top. So you got a good hold on that, Matea? Right about there. Okay, perfect. Now can I get some separators? Who can make big circles with their hands? Yeah? Yeah, you too. Yeah, all three of you, come on over. So I'll get you here, and then you two, I'll get you on the other side of the rope. It's quite the production. Now you're over here, I'm gonna get you to do big finger circles and pick two different lines. So, maybe get you right here. Perfect. Yeah. Two different lines. Both hands. Now big finger circles, you don't want to actually touch them. You take two different lines. Yeah, so you get Yeah, there you go. Awesome. Okay. So you, Captain Hook, are gonna stay where you are. It'll pull on you a little bit. Don't be afraid to give it some slack, because if you don't, you'll tip the machine over and you don't want that. When I say go, which will be after I start turning, you'll start sliding towards me and come all the way to the end. When 
he hits your hand, so just let go, all right? All right. For you? Perfect. But Perfect. you're gonna slide, and you're gonna, slide, as yeah. soon as you hit their hands, they let go. Oh. There he goes. Go. Yeah. 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 He's looking off, especially getting tight. Yeah. Wow. Go. Cool. Keep going a little faster, 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 Our bite, which is really important. I actually have to finish the rope. So, take that from you. Good job. Thank you very much. Now, who can tell me what this uh, what this is? This twine, exactly. This is twine. Does you know what kind of twine it is? Any ideas? It is. So the specific type is called size of twine. It is made of flax. And because it's made of flax, we don't want mice and bugs and whatnot eating this. So it's actually coated in kerosene. Anybody know what kerosene is? Yeah? I know it's a very, um, if you like, rub your hands on it, it would like, um, it's a lot more experience. It is very flammable. They used to use it in lamps and even some of our tractors we have here at the museum run on kerosene. So, very flammable stuff, but it also tastes really bad, which is why this rope is coated in it. So, that's why I really gotta make sure I wash my hands after this, because I can already smell them and they smell really bad. <laughs> so, I'm gonna take this rope, I made this little loop here. This is the most important part of finishing the rope. This is called our whip, and I'm going to whip the rope with it by bringing it underneath. Oh, it's <laughs> over. I'm just gonna roll it up the line here until I get it to this part here. And I'm just gonna put it through the circle. I'm gonna hold it in place now. And I take that short end I had, I'm actually gonna pull on it until it's finished. Nice. Now we have a whipped knot for our whip knot. Oh. And after I clean it up here. Boom, hey, you help make some rope, okay? So that, that's how you make a rope. That's nice. fine. Awesome. Cool. Think, think we can do that at home now? Yep. <laughs> All right, so I'll put this in a bag and then Captain Hook. Captain great, Hook. Great Captain Hook gets to keep the rope. <laughs> That's you, Captain Hook. <laughs> Isn't that nice? Come you get to keep your prize. Go get it. Good job, Matea. <laughs> All right. Oh, I didn't expect to get to keep it, hey? Yeah. What do you say? And who else would like some rope? Thank you very much. It's already made. Shake, shake. Just shake, shake, shake. After a couple of minutes, it'll get really quiet, and you got whipping cream, and then you gotta keep going, and eventually you'll end up with kind of a kathunk, kathunk, kathunk sound because you have butter and buttermilk. Wow, look at that. That's very cool. So then you can drink the buttermilk. Yes. 
and uh, you can eat the butter if you want or save it for home, save it for toast, for supper. Kind of shake, shake, shake. Yeah, you gotta keep shaking. So it's gonna take you a couple of minutes and the key is consistency. You gotta keep it moving. Once you get to the butter, then you gotta stop. Okay, oh. yeah, you'll end up with let's, this kind of a board. Let's check out, Michelle, what you got. I see butter in there. Wow. Butter! Woohoo! And buttermilk that you can drink. Really cool to see that they all still run. Oh, Lord, are we on the tractor ride? Yeah, this is pretty luxurious tractor ride. Yeah, look at the oh, Here we go. Is that fun? Woohoo! Stay it there. Hold by a tractor. When we go around the corner, maybe. We'll be able to see the tractor. We're in the tractor parade. We're in the tractor parade. I feel like I should be in overalls. <laughs> Should be in overalls and a straw hat. John Deere tractor. There's the Deere John. The Deere John. 